G'day, g'day and welcome to the first instalment of Kiwi Car Life Garage, a series in which I'll be working on a variety of awesome four-wheel projects every Friday for your entertainment. Now that my school exams are complete, I'm free and ready to take on the challenge of restoring this awesome project go-kart that I bought off trade me. I hope you enjoy the series, let's come take a look. Over the next few months I'm going to be restoring it to its former glory, with general maintenance, new paint and potentially a new engine. By the time I'm finished I should have an awesome looking and fantastic performing go-kart. Now because this is a project go-kart, it's not without problems. The previous owner had overridden the governor and locked the throttle on full, allowing the engine to over-rev. I didn't really want the engine to blow up on me, so I fixed that problem straight away. Also, it's one wheel drive which makes it an absolute one tire fire machine off road and very sketchy under heavy braking. There are other problems too like the pedals are in an awkward position making them hard to control and there's a useless little light up here held on with some hose clamps. Also there's a few holes in the exhaust and the air intake cover has been replaced with a chopped drink bottle. However in the coming episodes I hope to rectify all of these problems. <laughs> Why the beast up? Once the thing gets moving, my giddy heart, it wants absolutely hardcore. <laughs> yep, there we go, the one wheel drive. Let's go back down here. Oh, yes, look at that. I feel like I'm going probably between about 30 and 40 kilometers an hour. Oh, yes, it's got more left in it. Oh, jeez. Here we go, we're going to have this one full speed. Oh, it's a little bit nerve wracking going over bumps because it does seem to sort of shoot the steering down all over the place and it's very very whoa oh geez very twitchy <laughs> at high speed that's for sure but holy moly it goes well <laughs> yes it is oh, oh, the oh yes check out that man handling through there oh man <laughs> lock it up pretty bad there <laughs> oh yes as it tails off Feel the speed of the power no! Oh man, I got wet from that. Through the bend. Oh, the handling is really good though, eh? Whoa, geez. Okay, that's pretty good. the sketchy. This thing, oh geez. This is definitely not. <laughs> I can't even use the pedals. This thing is definitely not without its faults. But it's really not bad. <laughs> it's really not bad at all. Anyway, well, now the next question is. What's the capabilities like off road? Oh, yeah. Yes, come on, come on, come on, on power. On power, on power, on power. On power. Yes. Can we lock it up and spin it around? Oh, yes. Look at that. It even does donuts. The pedal's a little bit sketchy, but this thing, oh, yes. Handles the bumps really quite well. Locking up big time. Oh, yes, doing drifts. And now we're doing a bit of off roading. Oh, hear that bouncing off the web limiter. Okay, I think we're officially stuck. Well, that's going to be all for today. Next time I work on this, I'll be giving it a good clean and fixing some of the many problems with it to make it a little more user-friendly. But until then, I'll see you guys next time. Yeah.